and welcome back to Outpost Artico with me, Dalgon. Thanks for joining me. And this is Rehab and Outpost Artico. Um, where am I? Where am I at? <laughs> it's been a while since I've been back here. We are in a jungle biome. We got melons. There's a cat. It's an ocelot. Oh, I can't hear a thing. Pause. Pause. And I don't know what's going on. I'll have to. Um, I don't know what's going on. Weird. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, kid. Ocelot. Hey, kid. I don't know where uh, home base is, actually. Wow. I cannot hear a thing. What am I doing wrong? Hmm. Herm. I'm, I'm getting no sound from the game. What changed? Hmm. Well, let's see here. Uh, so, back that way. Back that way. Uh, I think what we were doing was finding uh, what I need is diamonds. Diamonds, diamonds, diamonds. Da, 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 da. I presume that is the chunkage I need to go back to. Word, I probably should have watched the last episode. Oh, man. Well, as I'm coming to you here from rehab, this was the first uh, day, uh, actually the second day in the classroom for me. Class, the classroom time has started pretty well. Um, and pleased to meet uh, my students. I had perfect attendance in one of my classes. It's glad to see that. It's a fully loaded battle stuff, fully operational classroom. Um, another classroom, I only had um, one student missing that day. And uh, so that's good. That's good. It's always good to see good engagement at the start of the semester because you never know what's going to happen later in the semester. Reminds me, I have no, I don't have a bucket, do I? Yeah, I do. I do have a bucket. Hmm. Well, let's, uh, let's see, let's grab a bucket full of water. And let's just make a staircase. Stairs. So one of my uh, student bands is playing uh, at Speakeasy Saturday night. I don't know if I'll make it. I have some obligations. Don't know if I'll make it to the Speakeasy, but it would be nice to have that alternative, that option. Basically correct, yes. 
correct? Basically correctly. Directionally correctly. Get back home. Look for more diamonds. Or was I coming out here to find other mm, a diamond rich zone? Has heard the De Beers Diamond Company, the cartel diamonds really aren't that rare. It's just that De Beers has created a rigorous near monopoly on it. I don't know if that's, I don't know how true that is, but it's kind of irritating, but it's true, isn't it? It's one way to create market. buddy of mine has convinced me to go see um, what's the movie Compton something something Compton straight out of Compton Dr. Dre the rise of um, rap and hip hop maybe don't know. Okay. whoa what was that something just fell so here's the uh, obsidian fired lava lake and there's our little shack love shack I'm going to pause this and go see what just fell Or just hop in the portal and uh, take a mystery ride. Take the magic bus. The bus, the magic bus. Every day I get in queue. Get on the bus that takes me to you. Let's see here. Don't sing, dog. Hmm. Do we need paper? How much paper do we need? Okay, I want to pause it. And I'm back. Back, back, back. Don't even know why I've got my earbuds in because I can't hear a thing. Hmm. Straight that way, a jungle. Don't know what I hope to find. Perhaps a village? Was that what I was looking for? put um, manufactured type items up there. So, um, I have been very busy at the home place. Now I really want another deal for ores. Set the bed, boom. Um, very busy at the home place. I just to recap really quick, it's been a while since I've been in rehab, so I'll refresh my mem memory and maybe yours too. Um, I uh, 
my divorce with my now ex-wife Sarah was final about well exactly two weeks ago exactly two weeks ago uh, and it already feels like half a lifetime ago um, sort of bittersweet in the moment but um, not, not even sweet just sort of bitter in the moment uh, but now not even feeling that bitterness just uh, disconnected from it it's, doesn't really evoke a lot of emotion in me now. Nevertheless, uh, what I was going to say was that my realtor, um, part of the terms of the divorce is that um, I am preparing the house, more or less preparing the house to sell. Uh, however, um, I have quite a while before I have to be out of the house, a couple of years in fact. Um, and uh, as a result, I have had mixed feelings about, uh, oh man, that, what is going on here? This is not doing what I think it should be doing. Um, there we go. At first I thought, well, you know, i got plenty of time. I'm not going to be in a hurry to leave. And then I was like, as as my situation becomes very clear to me, I'm like, why do you want to stick around, dog? This house has memories, you know, and um, many of them are good, but they're still they're memories of a former life. Um, you know, they're they're a time from you know long ago. So why would you want to stick around with these memories? And so the longer I do stick around, the more I think, I'm ready to just get this house ready and go. Sell it and go. Get the best price I can for it and go. Uh, and uh, on that note, I just took out the cooktop and the oven, which were, if not original to the house, they were at least here when we moved here in 1988, uh, 27 years ago. And um, I have new replacements coming in tomorrow to hopefully drop right in. Uh, the cooktop, I'm thinking, will drop right in place. The um, oven will require, I, I purchased a double oven, and I believe it will require uh, some creative carpentry to make it fit. Uh, however, I was pretty appalled and dismayed at how filthy and greasy and everything uh, the previous stuff was and uh, really affirms my decision to go ahead and just just tear the stuff out and replace it. I, my realtor uh, gave me good uh, advice with that. I also uh, was noticing that my old range hood needs to be replaced and she had told me that but I wanted to get the the main stuff done, you know, and um, I'll get to those to the range hood soon. What are you gonna think, uh, creeper? So first and foremost, though, just get the major appliances done. I have uh, tiled my dining room. That's complete. I'm not happy with the job that I did uh, for several reasons. One of which is that I put the mortar joints, the grout joints, too wide. They're half-inch joints, and they should have been a quarter-inch because the the mortar, the um, the tile that I chose is it looks like wood. It's a wood-look tile, and uh, you know you you want it to look as if it's it's, it's wood planking that's butted up against each other and instead it's got a wide grout joint. So so kind of screwed that up and uh, not happy with that. And also I've got some broken tiles that need to be replaced, but I was just so sick and tired of the job. It just kept dragging on and on that I was just ready to finish it and to see it. And uh, now I see it and I'm pretty much ready to just bust it all out. Just get a jackhammer, um, there's a specialty tile removal tool that you can get in and just 
basically like a jackhammer with a flat uh, blade that will bust up stuff kind of more or less sideways uh, from the side and um, and then get a power sander and just uh, sand and clean the floor down to a slab again so anyway I'm, I'm sounding kind of negative on that because I I am kind of negative on it um, and um, so we're headed north so our base is back to the south uh, I just I'm not happy with it in, in in many respects I'm just not happy with it so uh, but but you know I had to do it mm, like I told a guy recently I, I've always had to screw things up before I know what I really want you know so um, I always had to fail before I have a clear idea of what to do and what I want we could also find a jungle temple perhaps that would be pretty darn cool wouldn't it really, really darn cool in fact here in outpost Arctica we're in a sunny jungle not, not much Ar Arctica anymore Kautika Enjoying the start of the semester, though, uh, it pretty much came at a good time because I was really getting tired of working my butt off on the house, uh, and staying in the house, and although I was getting out a bit, meeting folks, I wasn't really getting out enough, and uh, uh, just single-minded focus on getting the house ready for sale, really kind of getting me down. So, really good to take a break from that. Oh, that's beautiful. That's a savannah biome there. Everything just kind of opened up here. This is nice. And I think I've probably talked about this. I'm not exactly sure I want to stay in the old um, house on the hill that we have raised, planning to rebuild. I'm not even sure I want to rebuild it. So in part, I'm looking for a new, pardon me, I'm looking for a new uh, homestead, a new place we can call home in Outpost Arctica. Time to get in the bed, okay. Uh, it's the wee hours as I record this, three o'clock in the morning. Um, had an odd dream and woke up from it and uh, it's been an odd dream, that's a house and a village perhaps mm. there's Jenny she's kind of hobbling right now she's got a bad front paw I don't know what's going on with it come lay down that's my good puppy come lay down oh hello village oh yeah hey we found uh, we were kind of looking for this weren't we village and villagers oh dude oh you could totally do some leather for a emerald. <gasps> You'll take rotten flesh for an emerald? Oh, dude. Um, pardon me while I uh, block you in and don't let you out. Actually, um, are you still on that dude? Ah, oh, sure. Note to self, block everybody in. Especially when they have good trades. These guys are good too. to call home. Who's that sound like? Uh, 
So, uh, let's see, kitchen. I'll be replacing the countertops and probably should replace the countertop before I put in the new cooktop, but um, I do kind of want to just get on with my life and have a new cooktop, especially since the old one's gone, like I know where to cook. <laughs> uh, they'll be delivering it at some point uh, today, later today, and so Ah, your brother's still in there, isn't he? I think. Maybe not. Let's see. Come on, son, I'm still still. Okay, so no blacksmith shop. Fisherman. Oh, they have titles now. Fletcher. Oh, lovely. lovely, lovely. Oh, I wonder if there's a, a chest up here in the, in the town hall. Cleric. Let's go see. Sort of don't think he's going to come up here, but we'll do this for brands. What else? Um, did a lot of cleaning of my pond lately. do a lot more. <laughs> Turn the this way. I have a roofer coming later today to replace my roof. That's another thing the realtor told me was to go ahead and get the roof replaced while I still have the same insurance coverage. So I filed a claim uh, right before the divorce was final, and mm. not done. Also, uh, one issue with the divorce was I was on Sarah's health insurance, and now I am not. Uh, and so I had to um, file for the Affordable Health Care under the Affordable Health Care Act, and so and so I'll be paying for my own health care for the first time since I was an engineer. 10 years ago and um, so also the uh, auto insurance policy has changed folks have dropped off of my policy just me and Brett now on the policy and that's good pretty much probably more or less probably save a little bit of money, money each month uh, depending on probably save a lot each month depending on what kind of health insurance I get. Okay, so we were going north and now we're just made a left turn and going west. Which 
check out this jungle area. I keep looking for like a temple or something. It's something with loot is what I'm looking for, really. Although I guess there's only so many diamonds I would find. In a temple or a desert temple or a jungle temple. Jungle ruins. Blacksmith shop. At the end of the day, I'm just going to have to dig for the diamonds I need. I know that. Oh, and I put that bed down, so I don't have sheep. So I need some sheep. Thing, Big Jim. Jim's been having some tummy issues here lately. Searching for a better food for her. Chunk edge right there. I wonder why in the world that would be the old trunk. It wouldn't. That's new terrain. But this is new terrain as well, isn't it? That's odd. I'm looking for sheep actually right now. I, um, my weight has stabilized around 175 uh, after a pretty significant weight loss earlier this year. It's, it's stabilized. It's still, I'm not happy with it. It's still too high. Um, I need to be around 155, 160. And I got stuck at 175 in the 170s and I can't seem to get beyond below that. Uh, here's a is that a barnacle tree? No. Um, but it's, you know, I'm okay with the plateau. I, I need to get accustomed to the 175 and uh, know how to manage 175 really well without it bouncing up back up. So I'm happy to hold here for a while, if I have to, but I would love to get lower again. I have been eating rather too much of late. I started to say poorly, but that's not really not the case. Um, there are times I have eaten poorly in the last few weeks, but mostly I've just been eating too much. I need sheep in order to sleep. I saw trees and thought they were sheep, which appears to be the case. Ducks, you aren't helping. Chickens, duck chickens, chicken ducks. Press 
Onward. Oh. Level 20. Good. Top we come without sheep. How much wool do I have? One. You have one wool dog. Uh oh, this is rehab, man. Uh, we're probably gonna need to run until we find sheep. Keep running, dig a hole, make a bed. Get plenty of food. That's good. Okay, well, prepare for an exciting conclusion to this episode because we must find wool. We must find wool. Is that a spider? Sheep, give me some spawn. There's sheep. Nope. Chickens. Not sheepers. Jeepers, creepers. What'd you do with my sheepers? Jeepers, creeper, creepers. Hmm. Don't be in a jungle. It's probably not the best thing for me to do. Oh man. Whoever said I had the best ideas? I'm best in class because there's no other. No one else in my class. <laughs> That's good. What else have I done around the house? Um, I got carpet cleaned, hired a professional carpet cleaner, and then. Jimmy promptly, that very next day, she promptly did a piddle right on the clean carpet, right on the corner of it. And uh, thank you, Jimmy. Thank you, Jimmy. Um, she also did a poop, but after I had torn out some carpet, and so it was easy to clean right on the concrete slab. Uh, thank you, Jimmy. I think I have circled around. Usually you do. When you circle, you usually do go around. It's a bit of a redundancy. Mm. Yep, this, this, okay, we got diamond armor. We're fine, we're gonna be fine. Fine, sheep, chicken. Ooh. Oh, and we're getting hungry. Corner, up here, up here. And boom. Cool. All right, we're in good shape. Food wise, let's go back to the desert, I presume. I suppose. This episode has no sound, I mean, cut 
it could go anywhere, basically. It is a cut. Zombie had long arms. Witch, a witch. Uh, get out of the witch. Get out of the way, witch. Whoa! I got a ravine. Wow! Look at that. Hmm. I don't know which way we're going. Sheep. Sheep. where I can build stuff. Come on. Oh, where's my wood, man? Yeah, I see him. I see him. Don't leave me alone. Can we make it? Can we make it? Oh yeah. See you next time.